hey guys welcome back to my channel for today's video i'll be doing a kind of wind down with me nighttime self-care just a little bit of pampering before bed so that i'm fully relaxed this video is sponsored by sephora so thank you so much to them for working with me i am obsessed with shopping at sephora they have so many brands and products to choose from and i've been able to keep a rouge status for about a year now which does come with a lot of perks if you guys want to sign up for sephora's beauty insider program the link will be in my description it's 100 percent free and you automatically become a beauty insider and you can start racking up points every time you shop all the products in today's video can be found at sephora.com so make sure you check out my description box for the links to everything i use i'm gonna start off tonight's self-care with a shower so i'm just putting my hair up and in a bonnet and shower cap so that it doesn't get wet Then I'm just going to turn on the shower. I'm going to be taking a warm shower and first I'm going to exfoliate. I'm using the Way Scalp and Body Scrub and I actually have a full shower routine on my channel where I used this exfoliant. This is one of my favorites. It smells like you're on a tropical vacation and it's non-drying. It's very thick as well but also gentle on the skin. I like to exfoliate first so that I can rub off all the dead skin afterwards. So I'm just applying it all over my body and scrubbing in circular motions. I'm not going to be showing a full shower routine in this video. So if you guys do want to see my full shower routine, you guys can check it out. It's on my channel if you're interested. Next, I'm taking the Necessaire body wash and I'm going to be washing my body with this. I've also been using this product for a while and it's again one of my favorites. It suds up really well and it's also very gentle so if you have dry skin this won't irritate you. It doesn't have a scent but if you want you can mix in any scented soap or body wash with it. I usually do like a little bit of a scented um, bar of soap. So I just wet my loofah, pretty self-explanatory, and I used a generous amount of the body wash. I'm using it all over my body besides my lady parts. I just use regular Dove soap down there. So just going to be scrubbing all over my body, washing, getting all clean before I take a bath. Next, I'm gonna be shaving my legs and I've discovered the best product for this. I'm using the, I think it's L'Occitane, I don't know how to say it, cleansing and softening shower oil. And this is an oil and a cleanser, which is why I'm able to shave last. So I usually like to wash my body off after I shave, but since this is cleansing, I can just rub the product off with water and it's gonna get all of the loose hair off of your body. So you can also use this as a body oil or body conditioner to moisturize your body before getting out of the shower. It's very hydrating and it smells so luxurious. It has a subtle almond scent, but it's also very clean smelling. Now that I'm out of the shower, I'm going to do some skincare, but first I'm going to prep my bath. So I am turning my water on. I like my water to be pretty hot um, and I'm adding some bubble bath. And then once the bubbles are formed, I'm going to be using the Whey Chill Pills. I'm just going to be breaking one of them in half and placing them in the tub. These are infused with notes of jasmine and rose and have hemp seed, jojoba, and safflower oil. So they're both hydrating and relaxing. They also smell amazing. The scent is very light, not overpowering, but still very prominent. So next, I'm going to take my Fenty Beauty scrub stick to exfoliate my lips and get them nice and soft. And afterwards, I'm just going to wipe it off with a wet paper towel. This product is new to me, but I definitely prefer this over... A loose lip scrub because it's less messy and you can use it on the go throughout the day just whenever you need it to soften up your lips next I'm taking my new favorite lip product ever the summer Fridays lip butter balm in the shade vanilla beige and I'm applying that to my lips and when they say butter they mean butter the texture of this balm is so nice it's a very thick consistency but it's not sticky and the color is so pretty you can literally wear this as a lip gloss on top of your lipstick and i'm really happy i finally tried this out because it's not my favorite next up i'm gonna do a face mask this one is the dr jarts 
facial barrier mask and this is just going to help support hydration and help my skin lock in moisture. I'm just putting my hair out of the way and I put on a facial or like a spa headband and I'm applying the mask. It's a sheet mask so I'm just going to place it right on my face and I am going to be steaming my face today just to help the product penetrate deeper into my skin. This steam also helped for me to relax. You can just close your eyes and take a second and really be mindful while you're doing this. It just feels really good and calming. Now for my bath, I have some candles going for a relaxing ambiance and I'm also lighting my new replica candle. This one is by the fireplace and it literally smells like burning wood, but in a good way. Like you actually feel like you're relaxing by a fire and I have my little bath set up. So I'm setting up my towel, my wine and some products I'm gonna be using while I'm in the bath. So while I'm relaxing, I'm going to do some more skincare. I'm using the Summer Fridays Dream Oasis Deep Hydration Serum. And if you suffer from dry skin, this product really helped me out a lot. My skin was actually glowing and it wasn't greasy or sticky at all. So it has squalene, which provides deep and weightless moisture and glycerin, which is a humectant. So it's going to attract moisture to the skin. And you can also use this product at night and in the morning. So I'm going to apply the serum to my face and after I'm going to use, y'all see, I'm going to use my gua sha and I'm going to do a little face massage and then I'm just going to chill, drink some wine. I was currently watching a TV show, but use this moment to really relax whatever that looks like to you and for you. And remember, self-care isn't one specific thing and it certainly doesn't have to include a bunch of fancy products. Just make sure you're taking time for yourself and listening to what your mind and your body needs. If your idea of self-care is simply just laying down or taking a nap and doing absolutely nothing, that's okay too. Everyone is different, so just do what's best for you. So once I'm out of the bath, I'm taking my L'Occitane Supple Skin Oil and I'm gonna spray it all over my body. Be careful where you spray it because I got it on my wood nightstand and I was heartbroken, but this oil is perfect before bed because once it's rubbed in, it settles nicely into the skin and it doesn't leave a greasy or oily residue. Now I'm using the Laura Mercier Almond Coconut Body Cream. This smells exactly like cake. I definitely want to try out the other scents, but I'm obsessed with anything almond, as you guys can see. This is a very thick consistency, but it's so easy to rub in. And just like the oil, once it's rubbed in, it sets into the skin nicely and it doesn't leave any residue. So I'm just applying it all over my body. And when I say all over, I mean everywhere. I just don't show it because I'm not trying to show too much skin on here, but... Yeah, arms, legs, feet, chest, stomach, but you get it. And now that I'm in bed, I'm going to finish off my self-care with a sleep mask. This is the Superberry Hydrate and Glow Cream Mask by Youth to the People. And I don't know where this brand or product has been my whole life. I guess I don't really try new things that often, but... If you want to wake up with bright and hydrated skin, this works wonders and it smells very citrusy and nice. I love anything with a thick consistency because I feel like it just moisturizes better and I've already noticed a more even skin tone in the morning and I've only used it a few times. So I definitely recommend this one. It's a good one. All right, so now that I'm extremely tired, you can probably see it in my eyes, but I'm really relaxed and ready to get a great night's sleep. So that's pretty much it for my nighttime self-care. Let me know if you guys want to see more of these or if you want me to try out new products. Um, yeah, I love you guys so much. Make sure you're making time for yourself and putting yourself first whenever you can. And thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.